All right, here we are. We're going to have an episode of the series Sanctified with a Psalm. Today we're looking at Psalm 111, 111, and our hymn will be hymn 724 from the LSB, stanzas 1 to 5. That's hymn 724 from the Lutheran service book, stanzas 1 to 5. There's a good 10 stanzas. We'll sing the next five uh, next time. Grace and peace be to you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ who went to the cross for us, who shed his blood for us, who washed us clean in that same blood by those holy waters of our baptism to declare us a kingdom of priests to serve God and his Father to him be all glory, honor, and dominion. This is most certainly true. My name's Pastor Gordon Nauman of Trinity Lutheran Church in Scarsdale, New York. You can find us at trinityscarsdale.org. Let's read the psalm. Praise the Lord. I will give thanks to the Lord with my whole heart. In the company of the upright in the congregation, great are the works of the Lord studied by all who delight in them. Full of splendor and majesty is his work, and his righteousness endures forever. He has caused his wondrous works to be remembered. The Lord is gracious and merciful. He provides food for those who fear him. He remembers his covenant forever. He has shown his people the power of his works in giving them the inheritance of the nations. The works of his hands are faithful and just. All his precepts are trustworthy. They are established forever and ever to be performed with faithfulness and uprightness. He sent redemption to his people. He has commanded his covenant forever. Holy and awesome is his name. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. All those who practice it have a good understanding. His praise endures forever. I can't say it better than that, so let's turn to hymn 724 and simply respond in joy with the first five stanzas. If God himself be for me, I may a host defy. For when I pray before me, my foes confounded fly. If Christ, my head and master, befriend me from above, what foe or what disaster can drive me from his love? I build on this foundation that Jesus and his blood alone are my salvation, my true eternal good. Without him all that pleases is valueless on earth. The gifts I have from Jesus alone have priceless worth. Christ Jesus is my splendor, my sun, my light alone. Were he not my defender before God's judgment throne, I never should find favor and mercy in his sight, but be destroyed forever as darkness by the light. He cancelled my offenses, delivered me from death. He is the Lord who cleanses my soul from sin through faith. In him I can be cheerful, courageous on my way. In him I am not fearful of God's great judgment day. For no one can condemn me or set my hope aside. Now hell no more can claim me, its fury I deride. No sentence now reproves me, no guilt destroys my peace. For Christ my Saviour loves me and shields me with his grace. 
Again, wonderful, wonderful lyrics and content there. Can't wait to sing the rest of the stanzas, really, but we will. Let's pray. Lord, please forgive me, a sinner. Remind me that it is by your suffering and pain, your stripes, your very death, by which I am healed. Remind me that it is your sacrifice that is my salvation. Thank you for this grace alone which saves. And Lord, sanctify me in this truth. Your word is the truth, and as the truth sets me free, so it is your word sets me free. This is, again, most certainly true, so it is for you and for me. And the Lord continue to bless your day, and perhaps you'll join us next time for another episode of this series, Sanctified with a Psalm. Take care.